Radio Craze. I'm Michelle. Thanks for joining me. This is Yoga with Shell, and we actually are going to use our block today. So block party. Let's start, um, however, with the block on the side. Play some fun music. Please like my page. I appreciate this journey that we've been on, and we have uh, 10 more days until it's done. So let's get after it. Let's begin today with a little bit of yoga. So toes together. Lift your arms high. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, back bend. Let anything off your chest that doesn't serve you. Inhale, reach tall. Exhale, fold. Bend your knees as much as you need. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold again. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, back bend. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, fold. We like yoga because we can find flexion of the spine warming up. One more time, sun A, reaching tall. Exhale, back bend, opening through the shoulders. Good, and finding a hamstring stretch in the fold. Inhale, halfway lift. This time, high plank pose. Top of a push-up. Find your palms underneath your shoulders. Breathe in. Exhale, downward facing dog. Set your tailbone high. Bend your knees as much as you need. Lift your tailbone and melt your head between your arms. Inhale, lift your right toes high. Exhale, knee to nose. Puff up your shoulders. Inhale, right toes high. Exhale, knee to nose, low lunge. Land light. Inhale, cow. Drop your knee down to hover or to support you. Exhale, cat. Step your left foot forward so both heels are down as you bow over your knee. Good. Inhale, warrior two. Slide your feet apart. Your front knee is over your front ankle. Expand your arms long. Good. Then straighten the knee as you find your elbows together. Good. We're going to just find a little warrior two jack. Good, close and open, close and open. Breathe through this, stay long and hold, hold, lift your left arm. Inhale, right arm high, exhale, down to the low, lunge. Kick back your right toes, breathe in, exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, left toes high, exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, left toes high, Exhale, knee to nose, low lunge. Tend your fingertips, inhale, cow, drive your hips forward. Exhale, cat, like pyramid, step your right foot forward and bow over your left knee. Breathe in, breathe out. Inhale, warrior two, spiral your arms wide. Good, exhale, straighten your leg and find opposite elbows. Good, open and close. Open and close. A little warrior two jack, opening up the hip flexor. Breathe, lengthen, we're here for three. For two, warrior two, hold long and strong. Inhale, reverse your warrior. Exhale, down dog kick, plant your palms, kick your left toes back. Big breath in, exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, shift forward, high plank pose. Exhale, knee to left shoulder. Inhale, back to plank. Exhale, opposite knee, opposite shoulder. Good, this is a variation of a mountain climber. Good, crossing the body underneath. Start it slow, cross and breathe. Keep pressing up your shoulders. We'll pick it up, my friends, in four, in three, a little faster, in two, and one. Drive it up, up, up. Good, first round mountain climbers, up, up, up. Breathe through it, belly's on, up, up, up. Knees a little bit higher. Breathe, you can do it, a little higher. For eight, seven, six, five, just four. Here's three, just two, and one. Look forward from down dog. Exhale, step forward. And rise to stand. Grab your block. With your block, step your right foot on your block. So have the block like a hot dog, shining towards me. Feet are hip width distance, toes are forward. It's a sumo squat, down and up. Good, knees go forward. Drive your knees forward like your toes. Hence the heart, lower and lift. Amazing work. How low can you go? Booty down and up. 
All we really need, friends, is three minutes of squat a day. If you can commit to this 30 minute practice, you're gonna be in tip top shape, I guarantee. Down and up, good, breathing through it. Because we do the work now and we show up for ourselves for the rest of the day. Good, increasing our metabolism. Good, finding good nourishing food to fuel you after your workout. A little protein within 30 minutes and lots of hydration. Good, knees continue to drive forward. Good, breathing for four. Stay low in three, last two, and one, stay low and dip. Just dip and dip. You can send your palms forward for a little bit more. Dip, dip for eight, seven, six, five. Just four, three, two, and one. Listen, stand on your block. I know, it's a little bit tricky. Good, so your left toes are hovering. Lift and lower. Your left leg just straight up. So a little bit of relief after those squats. Still working. Hands can go wide for a little bit of balance. Or hands to your hips. Keep flexing your left toes. For four. For three, it's okay if you fall out. Last two. Stay lifted and pulse. Little lift, little lift. For eight, seven, six, and five. Just four, three, two, and one. Lower down. It's really tricky. Slide that look block underneath your left foot. Squat it out. Knees and toes are forward. Lower and lift. Good. Focus on good form. Good, the knee is still not over your toes, so leaning back. Lower and lift. You can handle it. Drop it and lift it. Squeeze your glutes at the top. Committing to that exhale. Exhale. For eight, seven, six. Hold low and dip it out in three. In two, and one, so good. Just dip, little dip. When I dip, you dip, we dip. Let's can go forward. Good, engaging your belly. Little bounce, little bounce. For four, for three, for two, and one. Rise to stand on your block. Lift right leg and lower. Lift and lower. Good. These blocks can be used to support us but also to challenge us. Arms can go wide for eight, seven, six. Flex your toes, finding balance four. For three, tiny pulses in two, and one. Just lift, lift, straight up, straight up. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Amazing effort, step off your block and find a lunge, but you're lunging from the block. So find um, a little bit taller. You can decide to go flat if you want. Good, your back toes, your left toes are gonna be on that block. Lunge way forward, so a point where your knee is gonna drop straight over your ankle. So test it out. Trial when you bend. You need to hop your right foot a little bit farther forward. Good, then we'll find lunges right here. Lower and lift. Good, straight down and up. Toes are to that block and you can change it up. Good. You want that wide lunge so you don't hyper extend. Square hips, lifted chest. Good. Keep breathing, amazing work. These blocks really can make you stronger. Help your form and also offer support. Keep lowering and lifting. Good. Dig deep for eight, seven, six. Hold it low and pulse. Yes, you can. Here's three. Here's two. Burn out that lunge. Here we go. Just dip and dip. Hands to heart. Believe in yourself for four, for three, for two, and one. Kick it forward. hi -yah. Let it go. Find the other side. You can choose the layer of that block. I'm gonna to try to keep it the same, although it's really tough. 
Good, find your little lunge, like a starter block, right? So decide if you need to hop your foot a little bit farther forward so that when you lower, your knee drops straight down. So lean back with your chest, right heel to the block. Here we go. It's dip and lift. Straight down and up. Good. Your knee is almost touching the mat. Fire it up. Good. Keep breathing. If you need to rest at any time, you know this is your time, your journey. So just break if you need it. Breathe. Exhale. Just down and up. Down and up. I know. I know. I'm with you. This is it for eight and seven. Six, we will hold low and pulse with all our might. And four, and three, stay with me for two. And one, this little dip for eight, seven, six, kick it forward. And four, three, two, hi -ya. Kick it forward, then pause, find a fold. Good, grab the pose, grab opposite elbow, and sway side to side. After enough rest in your ragdoll, friends, take water if you need it and prepare for this next one. It's going to be fun. We're just going to tap, tap the block and squat. So send that block right in front of your feet. Knees are forward. Good. We're just going to tap and reach our arms up. So it's tap and reach. Heels lift. Good. Heels are lifting. Breathe through it. Tap and reach. Tap and reach. You can do it. Booty's back. Just tap it out. Tap. Good. Lifting heels at the top. Stay strong. Commit right here. Here's eight, seven, six, and five. Just four, here's three, grab the block, in one, good, grab that block. Next move, we're gonna plant the block, hold the block on the sides so thumbs are forward, find your plank. We're gonna hop forward and grab the block. You can take it as slow as you need, so plant, step, step, forward, forward, lift heels, or find the hit, We'll hop it out. Here we go. You can choose to hop at the top. It's a little block for B. Now we've got the hang of it. Here we go. Eight. Seven. Little hop. Four more. your breath. Good. These high intensity uh, movements are very challenging and we're not done. So breathe in the yes you can and breathe out. Breathe in. I won't stop. Can't stop. Won't stop. I will conquer. And open mouth exhale. Ha. Good. Slowly lift up. Take a seat. And take stop. Walk underneath your left heel. Good. Start right here with your knees high to the sky. Scoot your seat a little bit farther forward. We're going to find glute press with our foot on the block. No weights, okay? It's a lift and lower. Lift the booty, lower the booty. Lift and lower. Good. Left heel's on the mat, just lifting and lowering the glutes. Squeeze the glutes at the top. A little different than yoga bridge. Lift straight up, straight up. 
Drive your left ankle on that block. Perseverance is mind over matter. Inspire yourself to show up for yourself because you deserve it. Here we go, final eight, seven. Now prepare to pulse because we will. In four, in three, in two, tiny dips down and up. Here we go, just dip, little dip. Little lift for eight, seven, six, five. Static hold, four, three, two, one. Hold, you can stay here or lift your right leg up for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hug your knees to your chest. Good, now swap your feet. So send the block underneath your right foot. Good, glute press, and knees are high. There's space between your hips. Good, and slide a little closer to your heels. Palms down by your side, mentally prepare. And then start to lift and lower your hips. Let's go, it's up and down. Little lift and lower. Squeeze at the top. Drive your heels down. Lift your heart, your spirit is high. Accept the challenge and dig super deep. 19, to give you a count. Down and up. Keep lifting. I know, I know. Final eight, seven. Good, prepare to pulse. A little bit more. Just four, just three. Last two, last one. Little dip, little pulse, little up, little up, up, up. You can do it for eight, seven, six. Keep a little lifting. Four, three, two, one. Good job, send that block between your feet, knees out wide. Hands can come to your hips. Assist, the hips open, breathe for a moment. Between your feet, grab it between your feet. Interlace your hands behind your head. Good, we're going to lift our elbows towards our knees, clamshell sit-ups, hold that block between your feet. You can choose any which way. Good, lift for two, then lower. Good. I need a little smaller setting. So squeeze that item between your legs in for two. We'll continue. Lift up for two, then down. Try to tap your elbows to your knees, lifting your shoulders. Up for two, then down. Up for two, then down. Eight total, so four more. Then down, you can do it. Three, good, crunch in two. Reach your palms towards that block. In one, stay crunching palms forward for eight, seven. Can you tap your block? In four, we're gonna grab that block in two and one. Grab that block and lower your legs down, arms long. Breathe in and out, we're gonna play past the block. So lift your shoulders past the block to your feet. Then down for two, then up for two. Slowly pass that block between your hands. Lift and lower. Good, find your breath, to lift for two and lower. You can do it for eight times, so four more. Lower, amazing effort. Stay strong, lower and lift. Last one, good, lower your head, lower your head. Good, now send your left hand behind your head and hold that block to the right. Crunch to the right, extend your left leg long, then lower the left leg and lift it for two. So left shoulders off the mat, leaning towards the right, lower for two and lift for two. We've got eight, so keep moving with ease, strongly, keep lifting, keep breathing. Four more. Stay with me. Amazing effort, shaking is good, you're building strength. Keep lifting and crunching. Good, hug your knees to your chest for a moment. 
Breathe in and out. You can do it. Take as much time as you need to find eight of these bad boys. So send your right elbow to that block in your left thigh. Hand behind your head, crunching left. Crunch left, extend your right long high, then lower and lift your leg eight times. Hover, flexing toes towards the sky. Amazing effort, stay strong. Keep exhaling, friends, for four. For three, we'll end in a fun little pass the block between our legs, like a basketball, in one, good. So find your block and send your legs up the wall. Make a little space, open your legs. Good, and pass that block around your legs. Good, just pass attack, pass attack. Good. Four more. For three. For two. And one. Hug your knees around your block. Good. Hug your knees to your chest. Breathe in and out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Then rock and roll forward for block push-ups. Rock and roll forward. Good, and pause before you start your push-up. Send your right hand on that block. And I just want you to sway your tush side to side. Your hips move. Go right and left. Just feel the vibrations of your strength. You can decide, knees or toes, right hand on the block. And but first I want you to sit in this tabletop. Just sway it out and come to stillness. Inhale, cow, and exhale, cat. Round your spine, releasing any tension. Tell yourself you can do this. One more here, then around, and find your block wide, wider than your mat. These are wider push-ups, knees or toes. Let's start from toes and come to knees if you need. So step your toes back, front hand on the block, and you may need it partly on the mat so it doesn't slip. Here we go, it's down, and up right away. You can choose to come down to your knees. Good, we have eight total with a little pulse. So fire it up. Elbows stay over the wrist, strong, almost bobbing your nose. Breathe through it. You can hold low in four, in three, make it slow for two, and one. Stay halfway, then dip, dip, six, Five, four, three, two, one. Child's pose. Knees wide, arms long. Catch your breath. Breathe in, breathe out. Good, slowly rise up. Find that block underneath your left hand. Mentally prepare. You can do this. Take cow cat before it if you need it. Your thumbs are on the mat. Shift forward, start with toes. Good, bend and press, eight total. Lower and lift, you can do it from your knees. Good, it's still hard, lower and lift. Try to stay wide and with intention. Drop your nosy straight down. You have four, stay with me for three. Stay halfway in two. And one, now stay halfway and dip for seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Child's pose, knees wide, arms long. Breathe in, breathe out. Catch your breath and when you're ready, rise to stand. Grab your block and place it off your mat between your legs. Take your block, and we're gonna step feet hip width distance. Good. On or off your mat, you can decide. We're gonna slam our block. We'll start with the tap of the block. Hold that block in your hands. Get anything you want to get rid of off your chest. Here we go. We're gonna start just with a little bend and tap. Tap the block, handstand. Tap the block, handstand. Tap the block. Yes, you can. Tap and lift. Are you ready to slam it? Come on, in eight, in seven, we're gonna find a hop and a slam of the block. In five, in four, in three, 
in two, and one, here we go. It's hop, and slam, hop, and slam, just eight of them. Get it off your chest, up, and slam, up, and slam. Three more, two, and one. Here we go, just for good measure, stand up. Good, amazing effort. Send that block to the side. Now find your sunny again, winding down, arms all the way up. Exhale, hands to heart. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, back bend. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, fold. Halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Halfway lift. Exhale, fold. From your forward fold, halfway lift. Exhale, come down to your knees. Good. Now just swivel into a circle, rocking your shoulders. Right, left, right, left, back. Swivel the other way, letting that block go. Good, send your arms forward and back. Expand through your shoulders. Good, and find a shoulder tap, right elbow bends. Maybe you reach for your palms behind your back. Swap out the grip, lift your arms up. Tap your left, left palm to your shoulder, right palm comes behind, bend your right elbow and maybe reach for the back of your shirt or your palms. Breathe through your shoulders, let it feel good. Feeling strong just with the body you have with that devilish block. Good, slowly find your palms to downward facing dog. Option to take a block with you for restore. Down dog for half pigeon, send your right toes high. Exhale, right knee to right wrist. Lift through your chest. This is a great place to place that block underneath your right hip. To feel more squared hip sensation. Stay here or fold if it feels good. Walk down to your forearms. Slowing your breath, so slowing your mind. Finding gratitude for showing up for yourself. Gratitude for new challenges. Elevated. Showing what the next step looks like in your body. Showing a new goal to persevere. Good, plant your palms. Remove that block. Set it to the side and kick your right toes back. Shake out your leg, bend your knee, scorpion dog. For a little fun balance, maybe tent near the fingertips. Can you capture your right toes? Reach towards that direction, maybe you capture. Keep pressing your right hand forward. And release down dog. Inhale, left toes high. Exhale, half pigeon. It's a backward seven shape. Right away, option to take that block underneath your left hip. Just help square your shin towards the top of your mat and find a, a nice deep stretch through your hip flexor, through your IT band, through your glute minimus and maximus. Come to your forearms if that feels good, but only if it feels good. And now you can always roll to your back for figure four. Right hip forward, left hip back. And being mindful that it's important to restore after these high intensity workouts. Gently lift your chest, let your palms send that block behind you. And if you like that extra challenge, you can kick your leg high, bend your knee, and maybe tend to your right fingertips. Maybe. You fall out, maybe you find your left toes behind you. Maybe not. <laughs> Wherever you're at, downward facing dog. Good, step forward, turn towards me. I'm just finding a fun punch up, punch down 20 times for day 20. So heels in, toes out. 
Here we go. We're gonna squat, punch down, squat, punch up. That's uh, that's one, okay? Down and up. Here we go. Squat, punch down, squat, punch up. 19. And up. Get it off your chest. Good. Fire it up. Squat, punch down, squat, punch up. Amazing effort. Ooh, Lally, we did it. Keep lowering and lifting. Punch, punch, punch. Get it off your chest. 13. Amazing effort. 12. For every day, punch it off. Punch it off your chest. You can do it. Right, left, right, left. Keep lowering and lifting. 3, 2, 1. Up, 3, 4. 3, 2, 1. Up, 3, 4. Down. And up. Here's 8. Keep going. Punch, punch, punch. 7. Punch, punch, punch. Give me the power. Show me pride, power, badass mother. Down and up. Down and up. You can do it. Persevere. Lower and lift. For four. For three. Never been better. For two. Almost there. Last one. All the way up. Hands to heart. With love and breath. Thanks for joining me, friends. To find a little extra restore, I want to show you an insider tip of how to use that block to help your shoulders. So come down to your mat, place the block underneath your shoulder, and um, it might need a towel underneath depending on if it's your personal block or not. Just um, acknowledging where your body is, I want you to lie that block right underneath your shoulder blade and your side. So lying right on the side and let your head be heavy. You can lie on your side body with bent knees and rock forward and back, forward and back, and you'll feel little glands. Now as you feel that soft tenderness, I want you to find the most tender spot and then stay there, stay there and breathe for two minutes on each side. It really stretches your lats and really will uh, soften your muscles and leave you feeling like you can stand a little bit taller. Have a beautiful day. Namaste.